Hey people, it's me again. So, anyways, I'm just testing out a new kind of format, you know. So, anyways, um, as far as that goes, I'm not sure when I'm going to be able to do, like, more edited videos as far as that goes here. Because there's always been some sort of money issue when it comes to a uh, new computer and all that, and I stated many times before about it there that I'm just not really sure if I even want to do it after all because it's been delayed many times because of the money constraints, you know, because of how we were putting all this money to remodeling the house and all this sort of stuff, you know, and we already just have like the kitchen being almost finished with the remodeling as far as that goes there's just one little final thing you know as far as installing the new range and the new the faucets and the new sinks for the wet bar and the new counters for the wet bar and all that sort of thing you know and then we're basically finished but then we're basically going to be taking a break for a couple of months and then do the entire upstairs as far as taking out the carpet and, and and remodeling the whole stairs and as far as replacing the sliding door in, in the main bedroom and as well as the balcony over there, you know, as far as that goes. And that's just going to be another major expense as far as that goes. And... I feel like it's just unfortunate there that I have to kind of put all my stuff on the wayside because of that. Even though they kept telling me, like, no, it's not really going to be a problem and all that, but every time I mention this sort of thing like there, it always seems like it is somewhat of a problem, you know. And then it's one of the things that I had gone around and, and uh, called out on my dad about that sort of thing and I probably should have called out my mom about that sort of stuff there too you know if they didn't want me to get a new computer you know they could have just said no and that would have been the end of it you know and instead of just souring it out for me and all that or, or whatever that word is you know like souring the whole thing you know you know and it's just unfair that uh, people could do these type of things to me, you know, like that, you know, and, and it's not like I'm, um, asking a whole lot as far as when it comes to that, you know, maybe just a K or two or whatever, you know, that sort of thing, you know, but, and then I think it was the fact that I had this sort of aversion to Windows 10 was the other thing why I kept wanting to do a Windows 7 and all that, and despite the fact that it's on its way out and all this sort of stuff, you know, but I just have this aversion to Windows 10, you know, and, and as I kind of stated before about all that, you know, with, um, with this sort of thing, you know, that when it comes to asking people for help, I feel like I'm now kind of a bit, a bit more wary of all that now because especially how some of these people that are supposed to help me they take control over it over the sort of thing when I'm just asking them to lend a hand not necessarily take over the entire project for that matter I mean that was really what was the matter with um, my uncle last year you know when it came to that, you know, that he was just taking control of the entire project there. When, when I really just wanted him to just show me how to put the whole thing together. As far as that goes. and Or to make sure that I put the, pri the, the parts properly in and all this sort of stuff there. Not necessarily trying to completely redesign the whole thing all together and you know and I mean that just really got me upset there as far as I know even though I never really got around and told them off I just didn't want to go around and rock the boat with that because although I think that uncle 
did probably be mad at one point or another, you know, a few times, you know. And it was like the same other kind of story that I said before about, uh, maybe it was like about two and a half years ago, I think, you know, where I wanted a new swim shorts, you know, or new, you know, swimming trunks and all that from, and I needed my mom's help just to get me the swim trunks, you know, but then my mom, again, had gone around, took control of the driver's seat and all this sort of stuff there, and wanted to redesign my entire wardrobe when all I really wanted from her was just to help buy me some pair of swim shorts and all that. Not doing all that sort of stuff there, you know. It's just one of those things I get, get, um, <sighs> well, speak of the devil, you know. I mean, my mom just texted me about, about leaving the coffee maker on, you know, and, and, you know, that sort of thing. So, anyways, um, I just had to pull it off of the, the socket there, you know, to turn it off. So, um, anyways, I think it's just one of those little things, again, maybe I just have to learn how to communicate better, but a lot of times I felt like I have such problem saying no to people, even if it's a, a big no of that sort, even a small no, I just have problems saying no to people, I don't know where that simply came from, whether it was just the years of that of therapy, you know, and how it was just, talk about your feelings, and all of this sort of stuff, and blah, 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 that sort of thing that was in middle school at that point, you know, but, honestly, that was, might have been the case, but they never really taught me how to be a little bit more assertive, you know, no, 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 it was just simply wanting to make me fall in line, or whatever it was, and honestly, I think those uh, those doctors and all that were kind of lucky at that point when they had the quick fixing like that with Baxel's Olaf and Prozac or whatever. Nowadays, if that were the case, you know, the mere mentioning of that sort of stuff would have probably would have raised a whole multi-million dollar lawsuit against the school district and the mental health organization and all that sort of stuff because of how parents today is have this not my child uh, glasses on you know or that my child is special glasses or whatever they call those sort of things you know but honestly it's just one of those things that I kind of grew tired of and all of that you know so anyways I guess that's probably it until next time so Talk to you guys later.